another day, another project. Hi, I'm architect May Angelica Aloha from Madag. Today, we are sharing you another project has finished and it is a modern Mediterranean two-story residential building. The lot area is 293 square meter and the total lot building area is 290 square meter. Let's go! By the way, our doorknob was ordered by Wilkun. This is the living area. It consists of 4 by 4 square meters. And you can see it has a glass chandelier. here. We ordered that from Manila. And also you can see it has a cold lighting to emphasize the ceiling design and also to make a um, great reflection on these spaces. And since there's a few things that you can see inside because a lot of some things they need to transfer a, a slowly or a little by little so that um, they can see what's inside. So this wall is intended for their uh, wall-mounted television so that they can use it to this area as uh, entertainment also. And also this uh, glass sliding door considered as another access outside. And it has a white coated uh, aluminum framing. And this is also considered as a fixed window or also a um, picture glass window. So let's go in the dining area. As you enter in our dining kitchen area, you can see uh, this breakfast nook is combined with its uh, it's their kitchen. This area is also intended for electrical gas stove. It has a uh, marble dark tone backsplash so that in terms of their cleaning, it is easy to clean this wall. And this area is served as their sink. This sink is, it has a gooseneck a faucet. This is called Busnet faucet. And up there, it is a built-in cabinet. Can store any things that they need to store, like pantry, or this area also is considered for their um, plates, utensils, and whatsoever. So let's go here. This area is for their dining area. I like the furniture because it is made of magpunu. Magpuno is one of the great tone wood that emphasizes the furniture in detailing. As you can see, it has a great finish. Great finish. And the design of the furniture is made of modern style furniture so that it blends on their concept on this house. And a little bit details like these flowers and also, uh, I almost forgot. <laughs> This area is also has a cold lighting in two tones. It has a bluish color light and also a warm white, emphasizing a modern calm color when you eat your breakfast, dinner, or any time you eat in this area. So, um, and my apprentice will share to you the other areas of this building. Thank you. Hi, it's me again, Don. Now I continue the touring. So, this area is the bedroom one, and over here is the bedroom two. Now, come, let's go to the entertainment room. So, this is their entertainment room. Can be used for gatherings, for guests. Entertain, entertaining guests. Yeah, you can just be here and just chill. Watch Netflix. Now, in this corner, we have the wash area. So this is a wash area. Intended for washing your hands, especially nowadays, we must wash our hands be sanitized always to avoid germs and viruses. 
So, let's go up. This is the stairs. So, behind me is a fixed window and a sliding area for intended to see the sky and yeah, beautiful scenery. family area it can be used for gatherings uh, gatherings and we can be entertained so much guests in here and just be here chill relax watch TV so this is the right here is the so this is a uh, railings that is black tube, made of black tube, yeah. and the paint is black. Now, we are here in the open below. So here in the open below, we can see the beautiful chandelier, and we can see down the guest, if maybe some guest, yeah, we can see some scenery and there's a lot of big fixed window. Now, my co-worker will continue the touring of this house. Thank you! Hi, I'm Jaisa Lubigas, one of the apprentices of AD Architects. And now we're at the second floor of, the, of this building. And first and foremost, let me show you how common toilet and bathroom is. So, as you can see, it is uh, used by 30 by 60 tiles with a ready-made shelf where you can put your shampoos, conditioners, or any sort of things that needs during shower and, of course, the shower itself. And the water closet. And lastly, the lavatory. The second, this is my favorite part of these rooms which is one space but two users, which is called loop. So, come on in. So, as you can see, it is elevated, which is you can put another bed in here and another bed in here. Or some, some users of this building are occupants tend to use this as a closet or their personal usage, which they have also the stairs. As you can see, the walls itself indicates that the occupant is a female, which is pink. That represents the color pink is feminine. Next, let me show you the bedroom floor. Come on. Bedroom floor, which is taking all the snow from the bedroom three. But it has a little different from the bedroom three, which is we have the terrace itself. So as you can see, it's overlooking from here to there. After that, we have the typical usage of it. It depends on the occupants itself. It is kind of spacious where two users or three users can occupy the space. One of my favorite part of this building is the masters. Come on. When you go inside, first thing that the users can use is where the walk-in closet lies. It has some drawers, drawers where you can put some clothes, um, open space where you can put some things. A top shelf where you can put some no lack of storage. Bottom shelf where you can put some shoes. It's a kind of a bit spacious. You can put lots of clothes in here. Yeah. Next is the master's 
toilet and bath. It's kind of a bit spacious. It's like 1.5 by 3 meters, which has an accent wall, which different shape the shower and the water closet and the lavatory. So it it's still the same design as from the common toilet and bath, which is a ready-made shelf where you can put things in there while you shower or anything. Then it has a block stove, which is kind of modern and manly. So it's black. And last, the master's bedroom itself, which lies the bed, which is king size. With a hint of wood, earth, gray tones, where the clients or the owner itself really loved. It has two fixed windows for owning. And from here, it's a curtain where you can see. The which is super, super, super duper good. So very beautiful. You can see the overlooking, overlooking view in here. So yeah. And for the last part, which is I'll introduce you and how seating works. So it has cold lighting. In the center of it, this has a ornament which represents as a flower. So, sometimes it can change color, it depends on the users, but yeah. Satanan, na successful. So, na po ako pasalamat po sa ilang mam, sa ilang kay mam Angelica, Boss Archie, na human ang mga pangandoy namo. So, ako ng ipaabot sa inyo ako, mam sir, o kung sa ako ng medyo na historia sa inyo ha. Hindi ko anak wala ako. Ano ah, ko ito ba nang? Kung ano ba? Ah, part o. Part o. Oh, oh, so, salamat kayo na kung na, 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 ano dito sa nanong na human. Siguro, thank you na lang sa inyo. <laughs>
bring with us with a finished project of AD Architects. It is a great pleasure to work with professionals and see the outcome of our hard work. For your plans and designs, get an architect. Woohoo!